Okay, my first suspension in clinic. Okay, uh, it was a snowy day. We were short-staffed. There were two doctors sitting upstairs. Uh, I had two patients coming in fairly close together that I really enjoyed working with. Uh, uh, I won't mention their names. They were great people. And the clinician, the head clinician, uh, Dr. Henson, wasn't there that day. One of the lower uh, clinicians and they say, if you can't do something, then go ahead and teach. And uh, Dr. Thalchi uh, came to me and he said, look, I want you to take this patient. I said, there's two doctors upstairs. There's two sitting upstairs. They don't have patients. Why don't you give it to them and let me treat my patients? And he said, look, take this new patient. I said, no, I've got two patients. I don't want this patient. There are two doctors sitting up there at the table. They are not doing anything. Give it to them and let me treat my patients. And he said, get out of the clinic. So I went upstairs. It was snowy. Uh, one of the Dr. Marks was up there. She said, you know what's going on? I said, I've been suspended. She said, for what? I said, I told her. She said, no, 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 no. No, it's crazy enough right now. The snow, everything, there's, every, we're short-staffed. You can't be suspended. So I went downstairs and I said, look, this is crazy. I can't be suspended today. There's just not enough doctors. And... Uh, the clinician went ape shit on me, threw me out of the clinic, not physically, just said, get out, get out, get out. Went back upstairs. I said, look, I got no choice but get out of here. And so I was uh, suspended. Uh, when the head clinician came back, I went to him and I said, here's my story. I've been out for three days and, and I don't think I deserved it. And he said, Come, okay, you're back to work tomorrow morning. Uh, the story I just told, when... I was, again, what had happened, one of my friends uh, said that he was going to take one of the clinicians outside and beat the shit out of him. I mean, this, because he said, he's just riding me. He won't leave me alone. And I said, okay, just give me a couple of hours. Let me stay with this. And so I started riding the clinician. Everything he said to me, I said something opposite. Everything, if he said blue, I said black. If he said yellow, I said orange. And that's when he gave me the Spanish-speaking patient, and that's when he came to me and said, I'm giving two of your patients away. And that's when I screamed at him, why don't you treat the patients if you're so damn good then? I used more verbal language at that point in time in the clinic. We went to the x-ray reading room, and uh, the clinician said, get off my back. I said, no. I said, when you get off Dr. Hall's back, then I'll get off yours. When you quit doing what you're doing to my friends, then I'll leave you alone. But I'm not going to stop until you stop. You are not, this is ridiculous how you're treating people. And so... He said, get out of the clinic. Well, I'd been kicked out once before, enough that I knew that he didn't really have the authority. And I looked at him, I said, no. He said, what? I said, no. I said, I'm taking up this up with Henson. I'm taking this up with the lead clinician here. When he comes back, I'll talk to him about this. If he says I should be suspended, I'll leave the clinic. But up until now, up in, I am staying here. I'm treating my patients because that's what I came to school for. I said, if you leave Dr. Hall alone, I'll leave you alone. I said, but this will continue, and you will not be able to kick me out of school. Now, it was a fun period of life. It really was. I, I had a blast. Uh, things shifted for Dr. Hall uh, because I was willing to do that. Uh, when I finished clinician, my, my clinic, uh, it was this doctor's job to hand me my pink slip, and he did, and he was all proud. And I shook his hand, and I did something that to this day I'm not proud of, and I am proud of. I took his hand, I said, don't ever think of a friend. I said, the way you treat people, I can never, ever think of you as a friend from here on in. But those were days that are gone. They were fun. They were exciting. They were miserable. They were uh, worth it. All of them. Have a fun day. Everything you've done has been perfect. Everything you've done has been the only way you could do it. So enjoy who you've been and what you've done. www.micpeakperformance.com